I couldn't pass it up, y'all. I just had to put it in the cart. It was just... <laughs> hey guys, what's up? Welcome back. Quick story time before we get into this. I was going in Target for one candle, you guys. One candle. I was watching Kyra Almanique. If you guys watch her, you know she will have you spending money. <laughs> so this one particular candle was sold out in one of my Targets. And I also could not get it shipped to my house. So I was like, let me see if my other Target has it. And they had it. So I went in there, got the candle. It smells so good. I went ahead and got more than one, which y'all will see. And while I was in Target, y'all, I got more things than I should have gotten. It's like five different bags, but that's okay. You guys like Target hauls. I like Target hauls. So let's do a Target haul. So go ahead, get you a snack, girl. Get you something to drink, get comfortable, and let's get into it. Okay, this candle, mm, I got bags and bags and like bags inside of bags, y'all. But the candle I'm talking about is called Maple Glazed Donut. If you don't have this candle, Kyra was not lying about this, y'all. This smells freaking amazing. It's sweet. It's like, ugh, it's like a bakery. If you don't like super duper sweet candles, you may not like this, but this smells so freaking good, y'all. You can smell the maple. You can, it almost has notes of marshmallows in it too, but mm, it smells so good, y'all smells delicious so I grabbed another one because I know myself when I like one candle I have to get the same one so I grabbed two should have grabbed one more because I really 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 like the smell of this but yes girl maple glazed donut if this is in your target get it if it's online well it was they couldn't ship it for some reason but um go to target smell it and get it it smells so freaking good i kind of went crazy on the candles i'm not even gonna lie i got three more this other one is another influence so i was watching tasha's stories on instagram um and she was saying that she liked this one better than the maple glazed donut candles so i went back to target because <laughs> i saw this when i was looking at the maple glazed donut i just didn't open it and smell it i was just more focused on getting this one um but went back to target smelled this yes ma'am this is not as sweet as the um, maple glazed donut candle but uh, it just smells so homey and soothing and just ah uh, it smells so freaking good so i got another one of these well another one of these big candles this is like a three wick candle and it smells delicious so I feel like I need to not buy any more candles, y'all. But since we're still on the subject of candles, let me show you the other two that I picked up. So this one was actually on clearance. And I, like, I read what it said, and I was like, I want it. Does it smell like coffee, though? Um, it says, I want coffee. And girl, literally smells like a coffee shop. And I like how skinny it is. How cute is that I should have grabbed a few more because they were on clearance. I might go back and get a few more, but mm, smells like a legit coffee shop. And then the last candle that I got is called Vanilla Birch. Don't know if you guys can tell by now, but I like vanilla a lot. Vanilla, caramel, just those warm, sweet type of scents. So I just can't get enough of anything vanilla but yeah it's called vanilla birch and this one isn't super duper sweet but it smells really good so yeah those are all of the candles that I got honestly I y'all if y'all see me haul another candle yell at me like for real for real yell at me <laughs> um okay next I got a mug how freaking cute is this mug like if you know me you know this is all up my alley leopard print pink and a mug how freaking cute the brand is opal house stoneware yeah opal house and she is just the cutest freaking mug i am obsessed i couldn't pass it up y'all i just had to put it in the cart it was just... <laughs> okay let's 
haul the things that I actually needed to pick up. I needed to pick up a few more of my um, cotton ovals from Premium. These are a little bit bigger than like the original small ones and I usually get these anyway so I had to re-up on these. I feel like all of my Target hauls, like every haul that I do from Target always includes these. So that just tells you right there how much I love them. Oh my gosh, y'all, these. I had to get two more. I'm currently using one, but I love, love, love these things. It's from Eco Tools, and they're like exfoli uh, exfoliating washcloths. So if you want a really nice exfoliation while you're bathing, these. I used to get mine off of Amazon, but I saw that Eco Tools had them, and they're sold at Target. Very, very affordable. So I grabbed two more. I don't use these like, I'm, I usually switch them out. That's why I always like repurchase them because I don't like to keep the same, you know, washcloth forever. Just kind of like a toothbrush. You know, you're supposed to switch out your toothbrush instead of using it forever. <laughs> but anyway, yeah, had to get two of these because they are bomb, bomb, bomb. And I also got another one of my favorite drugstore body creams. It's from Nivea. It's called the Cocoa Butter 48 Hour Body Cream. And this is for dry skin. I don't have dry skin, but I still like the extra exfoli- not extra exfoli- I was about to say extra exfoliation. The extra hydration. And when I tell y'all, this will leave your skin hydrated all freaking day. You bathe in the morning, you put this on, your skin will still be hydrated by the end of the night until you time like until it's time for you to bathe again if you you know bathe twice a day um but yes love love this this has made it into a target haul before too so had to re-up on that and i also wanted to get some more of my bior biore bior biore um nose strips and i saw that they had um the nose strip and face strips in one so I'm gonna give these a try. I mean, I like the nose strips, but they also have some that you can put on your forehead or just anywhere on the face. So I'm gonna give that a try. But as far as like, you know, the regular nose strips, I freaking love. So I had to get some more of those. And I also hear a lot of people talk about this patch. It's called the Mighty Patch. If you are familiar with the, um, um, Mm, what is that brand called? It's on Sephora. I know it's very popular. Peace out. Peace out. Yeah, those are very, very popular. But um, I hear that these are just like it. It's just way, way cheaper. So if you get blemishes or if you get like a pimple and you don't want to, well, you're not supposed to pop your pimples, but this helps with getting all of that you know the 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 gunk out but yeah you just put these on overnight or if you want to wear it throughout the day they have um okay so six original ones for night and six invisible ones for the daytime so if you want to wear them during the day and you don't want them to be super duper noticeable on the face they do have ones that are like invisible on the skin so this is just a smaller pack they have larger packs i just want to get the smaller one just to try it out see if it works, see if I like it, and all of that good stuff. So got those and on to the next bag. <laughs> um, oh, had to re-up on these feet masks, foot masks, foot masks. <laughs> this, um, the brand is called Holler and Glow. Every single time I do a Target haul or anything, about Target, Target favorites or whatever, <laughs> I'm always talking about these. These are my favorite foot mask, feet mask, foot mask, foot mask. <laughs> um, super hydrating and they just work really well, especially if you have dry feet or if you, I don't know, they're just really good, really, really good and they're cute. <laughs> but, um, and I've done a um, self-care video where I did like my pedicure, manicure, just an at-home spa day. And I featured these in that video. I honestly forgot when it was. I want to say it was last year, like beginning of quarantine, I believe. But anyway, I had to get two more because they are my favorite, 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 favorite foot masks. And I saw these when I was grabbing this. 
I saw this right here. This is the Holler and Glow. So it's the same brand. Um, Holler and Glow Coco Cutie Cuticle Oil. I've never tried any other product from this brand. And I saw this and I was like, you need it. <laughs> I need me a good cuticle oil. So we're going to give this a try. And this is how it looks. Super cute. Let's go ahead and try it now. I mean, why not? Coconut enriched cuticle oil. We're just going to go ahead and try her. I'll put it on my thumb. Yeah, I like how small the little bottle is because you honestly don't need it that much. Ooh. Wait. I have on lotion, so I don't know if I smelled this or the lotion. Don't know. But yeah, I can still I can smell a little bit of the coconut, but okay. It's not super greasy. Okay, I need a little bit more on this hand. Yeah, I just needed me a cuticle oil because sometimes they be getting dry and peeling. So I needed this. Oh, this is nice, y'all. Yeah, this is nice. I like her. All right, so, and these are press-ons, by the way. If you guys were wondering, I got them from CVS and they're the Kiss Press On Nails and yeah, but that's nice. Okay. I like it. Really cute. So if you're on the hunt for a cuticle oil, I think you will like this one. Okay. What else? Oh, I had to get another one of these from Shea, Shea Moisture. It's the African Black Soap. I wash my brushes with this soap all the time. Like, I don't really switch it up. I do have the um, the brush cleaner from Sephora. What is it? The Cinema Secrets. Um, but I use this more than I do that. And it just cleans my brushes so quickly and easily. And I freaking love it. So I had to get another one of those. And I wanted to try this out from Elle Cosmetics. It's the... Holy Hydration Makeup Melting Cleansing Balm. I love me a cleansing balm, y'all. So, saw this and I threw it in the cart. So, let me see what it looks like. Let me know if you guys tried this. Did I make a good purchase? Did it need to stay in the store? <laughs> let me know. So, it comes with one of these. And this is the jar. It says it has hyaluronic acid, ceramides, and peptides. And it's fragrance free because I don't really smell anything. So yeah, I'm going to give this a try and let y'all know my thoughts. But let me know if you have tried it. You know, let us know in the comments down below. Is it good? Did I waste my money on it? <laughs> let us know, girl. Um, on to the next bag. <laughs> so I ended up grabbing a couple of more repurchases in like the clothing section. Um, one of them, did I show you guys this before? I know I showed you guys the lounge pants. But I wanted to get another one of these Jockey, um, well, the brand is called Jockey, but these little crop tees, super comfortable, and I like that I can either sleep in it or wear it out, because it's not like, it doesn't look too pajama-y. It's like a regular t-shirt. So I got a black one. I have a white one already, but I wanted to get the black one. It has a little, um pocket right here and I have worn the white one out and about before so I wanted to get another one because they're just so comfortable and casual you can wear it with sweatpants you can wear it with skinny jeans you can wear it with boyfriend jeans mom jeans and it doesn't go all the way up like below your belly it well I don't want to say that because some people have long torsos some people have short toes short torsos I have a really short torso so it like it it doesn't show any of my stomach, but it is like a crop tee. 
and it's very, very, very soft, breathable. But yeah, that's the black one. And I wanted to get another white one because I wear white so much. So I felt like I needed another white one. And this is how the white one looks. It's just a regular degular <laughs> white um, comfortable t-shirt. So had to get another one of those. And then I love the pants so much. I saw that they had the shorts. These are the most softest, comfortable lounge pants. Well, the pants that I have are the softest and most comfortable lounge pants that I have in my loungewear wardrobe. <laughs> so I wanted to get the shorts and I just couldn't resist. They are the cutest, most comfortable things ever. <laughs> and I'm all about comfort, y'all. I live and breathe comfortable clothes. So I had to get some more of these. And plus I work from home. I mean, I'm always, always, always in comfortable clothes. And I always need some comfortable clothes because I work from home. Um, I got another pair. <laughs> this is the same exact pair. It's just a different color. And they have pockets, you guys. They have little pockets. So cute, but yeah, they have the pants if you don't want the shorts. I just wanted the shorts because I love the pants so much and I like to wear shorts around the house. Sometimes I, you know, sleep in shorts. So these are really nice, super soft, very breathable, and they're just super comfortable. So I got those and then on to the next bag. <laughs> so I have been eyeing this robe ever since they put it out. I think they put it out towards the end or was it the beginning of spring? I don't know, but I remember going in Target and I saw it, I was like, ooh, this is a new robe, but should I get it? And I never got it. So while I was in Target this time, I was like, I'm gonna get me a robe. I want me a robe, I don't need a robe, but I want this one. So I ended up getting it and this is how she looks. Okay, I might have to put this on so y'all can like really see it, see it, but the color, the material, it's just, it's everything, y'all. It's cozy, it's uh, soft, and this is just gonna be the perfect, perfect ball and winter robe. <sighs> I love it. Let me put it on. So the size I decided to get was medium large because I like my robes to be um, kind of big. And this is, oh, uh, y'all, it just feels so good. Okay, I'm gonna stand up, but and I'm sitting on the floor, by the way. <laughs> but y'all, it's just so warm and cozy and comfortable. Yeah, I feel like if I got the small, the sleeves, I like my sleeves to be long. So if I went with the small, they wouldn't like, the sleeves will probably be a little bit shorter, which I don't really care for. So I'm glad that I went with the, um, the large, what is it, the medium large. So let me show y'all what it looks like. Okay, this is her, oop, y'all saw a little leg. Okay, this is her. She is cozy. And it comes down, not like all the way to my ankle, but it's a little, I mean, I can't, y'all can't see it, but I'd say it's right, uh, right above my ankle. And this is how it looks very warm this white string goes inside like it ties up on the inside but this is it i am obsessed 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 with this robe y'all so cute and fuzzy and it has pockets right here yes all right i'm just gonna stay in the robe for the rest of the day <laughs> um but i have another one to show you guys yes i got another one which didn't need, but y'all, 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 y'all. This one I've never seen in Target. I think this is new. Correct me if I'm wrong, but this was my first time seeing it and I snatched it. This is how it looks. <sighs> y'all, the material, y'all, it's so soft. Look how cute, look how cute the robe is. So the inside is white. And then the outside, look how freaking cute. The outside is like a soft blush pink 
which I am obsessed with. Uh, let me show you what this one looks like too. So let me put this one on. And by the way, both of these are from Stars and Above, which is the best brand in Target. If you've never tried anything from Stars and Above, I'm gonna need you to go to Target right now, get you, girl, all of their stuff is good. Everything. I mean, I don't have everything. I haven't tried everything, but everything that I've tried from Stars and Above is nice. I've washed it over and over. It still has a good quality. Anyway, let me put let me put this on. I'm just talking y'all, but let me put this on so y'all can see how she looks. Yeah, this is going to be the perfect winter robe. <laughs> I love. I got a medium large in this one too because I wanted it to fit um kind of oversized, but y'all y'all I oh, let me not get makeup on this. Ooh. Hold on. Okay. All right. So this one isn't as long as the um, the gray one, but it is long. It's just not as long. The gray one comes right above my ankles. This one still goes below my knees, but she is so soft and comfy. You have the pockets right here, right there. Look how cute. Y'all. I just love me a robe. Oop, the light just went so dark. But I just love me a robe. But yeah, I think that is everything that I got from Tarjay, y'all. I don't need anything else. I don't need to go back there anytime soon because I feel like I got everything that I needed. <laughs> um, but yeah, girl, that is it. I hope y'all enjoyed this Let's call it a cozy fall Target haul. Yeah, because a lot of things that I show were like cozy things for the fall, so, and winter. So, yes, girl, that is it. That is all that I have for today's video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you enjoyed today's video, give me a huge thumbs up. Make sure you are subscribed because we are trying to hit 200K, y'all. We're trying to hit 200K. So make sure you're subscribed if you're not subscribed already and I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye.